hello to my amazing viewers in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to make nigerian party fried rice so as you can see here i have all my ingredients which i'll be using for this recipe lined up here first i will start by adding my dried thyme to my chicken next i will add my beni spices these spices is mainly for seasoning chicken next i'll go ahead to add my oregano Next, I will go ahead to add my dried rosemary into my pot of chicken. I know a lot of you might be wondering or be saying I'm adding too much spices to my food. Guys, these are just dried herbs which gives my food the perfect taste and aroma that I want. Next, I will add my dried basil leaf followed by my dried curry powder. After adding my curry powder, I will go ahead to introduce my salt and my chicken stock cube into my pot of chicken. add my wet chopped onions into my pot of chicken and after that i will add a small amount of vegetable oil i like to add vegetable oil into my chicken to enhance the flavor you can as well skip this one it's optional and after adding my spices to my chicken i'll go ahead to cover the pot and steam for about 15 minutes 15 minutes later i will check on the chicken add some water to the chicken enough water to cook the chicken until it becomes soft now i will go ahead to transfer my chicken into a bowl after cooking it next is to add my vegetable oil into my dried pot allow it to heat up before adding my chopped onions I'm going to fry this onion for about 5 to 6 minutes and after that I will add some seasoning herbs, continue stirring it so it won't burn. And after frying for a few minutes, I'll go ahead to introduce my chicken stock water and also my ginger, garlic and pepper mixture. Next, I will add my fried rice spices. After that, I will add some salt, add uh, some chicken stock cube. Next, I will introduce my curry powder. After that, I will give it a quick stir, cover the pot and allow it to boil. It's time to add my well-washed long golden basmati rice. This is the perfect rice to use for Nigerian party jollof rice or fried rice. And after adding the rice, I'm going to give it a quick stir, cover with my foil paper and allow it to cook for about 20 minutes. Guys, make sure you cook you cook the rice on a low heat to avoid it burning. Guys, 20 minutes later, I'm going to check on the rice now. Guys, as you can see, my rice is well cooked now. I'm going to mix everything together. And after that, I will turn off the heat and set the rice aside. Next, I will place my well clean and dried pot on the fire. Add some vegetable oil. 
allow it to heat before adding my onion i'm going to fry these onions for about two to three minutes before adding some seasoning herbs After I'm done adding some seasoning herbs, I'll go ahead to add my green, red, and yellow bell pepper. Next, I will add my well chopped carrot. Give it a quick stir before adding my salt and my stock cube. Next, I will add my sweet corn. And after adding my sweet corn, I will add my well-cooked green beans. Adding all my vegetables, I'll go ahead to add my rice to my fried vegetable. I'm going to continue mixing until everything is properly mixed. Next, I'll go ahead to introduce my fried liver into my pot of fried rice. Finally, I'll add my well chopped spring onions into my pot of fried rice. Guys, can you see how colorful and delicious my fried rice looks like? And also don't forget to like, comment and share if you like this recipe.